Hello learners. Now let's see how to prove that uh, cos square a by 2 plus cos square b by 2 minus cos square c by 2 is equal to this. If it is given that a, b, c are angles of a triangle. Fine. Now since a, b, c are angles of a triangle, I'm going to write it as like this, something like this. The condition would be a plus b plus c is nothing but equal to pi. Fine. Now if you'll observe my question, there's a by 2, b by 2 and c by 2. What I'm going to do is I'm going to divide this equation by 2 so that you know I can use the condition quite often. So this would be nothing but a plus b plus c by 2 is equal to pi by 2. And I'm going to split it in this form, okay? a plus b by 2 plus c by 2 is nothing but equal to pi by 2. Why? You'll understand. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll be using this condition twice. So you'll understand where I would use it when the situation comes up. Now let's take the LHS. Let's take the LHS. Okay. The standard you know, standard way is like, let's convert this cos square b by 2 to sin square b by 2. How? Cos square theta is nothing but 1 minus sin square theta. So cos square a is 1 minus sin square a. So therefore, the second area does 1 minus sin square b by 2. Push this one to the front and, you know, bring this uh, here. So this is what I'd be left out without this cos square a by 2 minus sin square b by 2. The rest is there. Now, cos square a by 2 minus sin square b by 2. This is something of the form. This is uh, something of the form cos square a minus sin square b. Okay, cos square a minus sin square b. What's cos square a minus sin square b? It is cos of a plus b into cos of a minus b. So I'm going to use this formula on these two terms. You'll get more clarity when you'll see it here. Okay, in place of a and cos square a minus sin square b is nothing but cos of a plus b into cos of a minus b. In place of a and b, uh, if you'll observe here, if you'll observe here, there's a by 2 and b by 2. That's why cos of a by 2 plus b by 2 into cos a by 2 minus b by 2. Yeah, since the denominator is same, you can just write it like this. a plus b by 2 a minus b by 2. Now, now, what is a plus b by 2? If you remember, if you remember here, I showed you guys, right, this condition. a plus b by 2, I can write it as pi by 2 minus c by 2. Okay. So, and again, don't forget to mention the condition. This carries mark and it puts a good impression on the examiner as well. What is cos pi by 2 minus c by 2? It's nothing but uh, sin c by 2 as cos pi by 2 minus a is nothing but sin a. So this would be nothing but sin c by 2. And one more thing. Here I know that I'm going to get something of the form sin c by 2. So I want this cos c by 2 in the form of sin c by 2. Okay. How can I do it? Cos square c by 2 is nothing but 1 minus sin square c by 2. So cos square c by 2 is nothing but 1 minus sin square c by 2. This is what you would see. These are the two changes that you would see here. Now following that. Okay, just multiply this minus to these two terms. That's a, so this would be minus one. This would be plus sine square c by two. That's the only thing which is now uh, one minus one is zero. So one, one would get cancelled. And what I'd be left out is sine c by two into this plus sine square c by two. Now in these two terms, I'm going to take sine c by two common. In these two terms, I'm going to take sine c by two common. If I do that, uh, I'll be left out with cos of e minus b by two plus sine c by two. As you can see, as you can see it here. Now uh, here I have e minus b by two. So want something in for in terms of like a and b here uh, i want to replace c by 2 with something like a and b how can i do it if you remember a plus b by 2 plus c by 2 is equal to pi by 2 so c by 2 i can write it as pi by 2 minus of a plus b by 2 okay a uh, basic condition which i showed you in the beginning c by 2 is nothing but pi by 2 minus of a plus b by 2 so in terms of c by 2 i have kept it here now next uh, what is pi by 2 minus a so what is sign pi by 2 minus a it's cos a so this would be nothing but cos of a plus b by 2 this uh, here I'm going to split the denominator to both of them like uh, a by 2 minus b by 2 plus uh, cos yeah, a by 2 plus b by 2. Okay. This is of the form cos of a minus b plus cos a plus b. Okay. This is of the form cos of a minus b plus cos a plus b. Or cos of a plus b plus cos a minus b. Like in any ways. Like, fine. What is that equal to? That is nothing but equal to 2 cos a cos b. Okay. It's nothing but equal to 2 cos a cos b. In place of in place of a and b, that's just a by two and b by two. That's why you know you have got to cause a by two b by to cause b by two and just you know bring the two here and rearrange. That's it. You've got an answer to cause a by two cause b by two sin c by two. Not just this question. I made mean, many more questions uh, related to uh, trigonometry. You can find the link to that playlist in the description. If you like this video, please hit the like button. And if this is your first time coming across across to my channel, please subscribe to it.